organization is Healing Touch for Animals. It's holistic health care using energy and attention. And the um, animals have uh, energy centers up and down the back of their back, four-legged animals, just like a human has energy centers up and down their front. And what we do is we um, assess the energy um, system and see what type of um, energy situation they're in, if they're having any aches and pains or any problems, any behavioral issues, any pre and post surgery type of, um, if they're getting ready to have surgery, um, uh, competition issues, rescue animals, uh, pretty much the gamut, first aid issues, pretty much the gamut of symptoms, we can help the animals. So what we do is we assess their energy system and then there are techniques given the uh, problems that they have that we are able to do to open and uh, the energy system get it to flow and then that starts which has a video that you will show or a uh, visual aid that you will show um, that um, starts by relaxing the animal the animal um, then um, is muscles are relaxed orphans are released um, Nutrients are better absorbed, uh, oxygen is better absorbed, it starts a whole physiological process which ends up strengthening your immune system and um, helping the body to heal itself. So like it's similar to if you broke your arm and a doctor put your arm in a cast. The cast isn't healing your arm, your body's healing itself. And what the cast is doing is stabilizing your, um, your body so that it can heal itself. That's what the energy does. The energy will stabilize your body and then give it what it needs to heal itself. And animals have such huge energy fields, much greater than ours, um, eight to 10 feet and beyond, so that they are very, very receptive to the energy and they respond very quickly to the energy and they will relax. You'll start to see their eyes soften. You'll start to see their breathing change. You may hear some uh, stomach gurgling. Um, and a sigh. They're just completely relaxed. It's like a spa treatment for them. They absolutely love it. And that starts the uh, physiological process and then the healing starts from there. And the healing happens not only on a physical level but emotional and mental level too. So that's why it's so good for um, rescue animals and for competition and for behavioral issues. So it's, it's a wonderful gift to give your animal. And I just really hooked by it and I just love doing it. Right. Um, I have um, that example in my own family because we lost a dog um, last May and there was of course a hole in our family so we needed to fill that hole and by August we were ready. So we um, found a, a rescue um, animal in Appomattox, Virginia. And so we went down there to pick up the animal. And it was a uh, flat coat retriever um, lab mix. He had a good life, but um, his owners had to move from their house. And instead of uh, taking him with them or surrendering him to a pound, they left him in the house. So the new owners found them and dropped him off at the pound. So very, very skittish, very afraid of any noise. And when we got him in our, in our car, he had an eight hour trip ahead of him and he was just just all over the place, just would not settle down. So I immediately started working um, healing touch treatments on him. He, within a couple hours, completely settled down. He wasn't cured, but he was able to comfortably take the trip, the rest of the trip home. And then in subsequent treatments after I got home, he completely assimilated into our family within about a month. He was very, very relaxed and it's just so rewarding to be able to you know, let the animal live its life. Um, massage works the muscles. Um, chiropractic works the nerves. And Reiki, very similar to Reiki, works the energy system. Acupuncture works the meridians that connect to the energy centers, but healing touch and Reiki work with the energy centers that, as I mentioned at the beginning, run up and down. Seven of them run up and down the front of us, up and down the back of a four-legged. 
So the difference between, the major difference between Reiki and Healing Touch for Animals is that Reiki is more about um, symbols and um, attunements and having the energy go where it needs to go, whereas Healing Touch for Animals is more symptom related. And so it, um, you have a specific symptom, there's a treatment for that specific symptom. And you can focus on that area and, and, and give the benefit that way, knowing that we're treating what needs to be treated at the time. We have a website that's www.healingtouchforanimals.com and also they can reach me um, directly by email at philadelphia at healingtouchforanimals.com.